So I'm going to show you how to groom a dog's feet if they're standing up. Dexter doesn't like to stand up, so it's easier for me to do him laying down. But Angel will stand up. And it's basically the same thing, just in reverse. So I take, and I, after I've brushed all their hair out, I brush it coming all the way down, hold their foot up, I trim around the front of their feet, come up the sides, trim all this off that's hanging out, come up this side, let me see if I can turn her around so you can see this better. Okay. So I've got this. Here's the her. Let's see where's. This is her the back of her her foot. Down here is her paw. So I pull the hair all the way down to the back of her paw, and I trim right at the back of the paw. I just trim it in a, I guess not a circle, but it's pretty much an oval, I guess. And I just trim all that off. This is awkward, but trim it off the pads. Okay. So there it is. And then you just brush it out, or comb it out, because they shouldn't have any tangles since you brushed them out before you started. Get it back here. Okay. So comb it out. So I keep her her hair leg her leg hair longer, but I do keep it trimmed up off the ground. So she goes out to potty. So I come back here. It doesn't get wet. So I come back here and I trim this off a little bit towards her foot. And I trim up anything that seems to be sticking out, move the hair, and I come back between her legs and trim. And I'm just trimming down like this to keep the hair off off the ground. Since I'm back here, I'm turn around. All right, so I've already trimmed around the foot, so I'm gonna come down here this way. And this just helps keep it dry when they go out and potty. And you wanna make sure you trim down, now say this way, down between the legs and on the inside, you want to trim it up off the, off the ground so that it doesn't get wet. And then I just kind of take it and look to see uh, how long it is. Uh, how am I going to get to this? Uh, here, let's trim this way. All right, can you see? Yes, you can. All right, so you see she has leg hair, but it's shorter. Okay, and I've what I've done is I've come this way and trimmed down, and her hair kind of sticks up, so I just nip off some of those edges. I know this is probably a big no-no in the grooming world. I don't know. All right, so she still has longer hair on her legs to make her look feminine and pretty but it's not touching the ground and when she goes out to do her business uh, she doesn't get as wet so you can see how long this is it needs to come up some so I basically do the same thing in the front let's see have I already trimmed up this paw Nope. All right, so I pull the hair down, I trim the paw. Her nails need to be trimmed. And I trim this up a little bit. I'm just kind of rounding it around in the front. Don't get yourself, I've cut myself. And then brush it, uh, comb it out, comb it out. It's a good girl. Yes, she's a good girl. All right, and then look to see how long it is. And I'm just going to get a little trimming, and I come this way with it, and get it up off the ground. I might have to turn your scissors this way. 
and just kind of trim it. Okay. So hopefully you can see that. Let me turn her around a little bit so you can see how her her leg hair is up off the ground. I'm just going to trim on the inside a little. All right, we've got to hold a paw. We've got to hold a foot. Trim on the inside a little bit. Those stray hairs. Uh-huh. See, it's kind of hard for them to lift their paw when you hold one up. Trim in the back and get that hair up off the ground. And it, from, if you're trimming from the side, inside, you're going to go up on this. You want this to go up this way. So I'm going up and cutting from the bottom up, making sure that it's shorter. And then it's, um, I don't know what the word is here, it just goes up this way, kind of curves. It curves up like that so that it doesn't drag the ground. All right, I'll let you go for now. Thumbs up if it was informative. Thanks for watching. Bye.